Uh, dude, you have to get the uh, over the top stuff out of your head. This, there's, the, it's a long way from over the top. There's your plane line, and you're under the plane. This separation comes from the club being stuck behind you. If you tumbled the club out, made the right left palm turn down a bit, got the club more out in front of you, and worked your body more to the right, you'd be better off. See that hang back? That's just a flip with your hands there because it's you're trying to square the face. If this was squared to slightly open right here, or where it's really visible is right there, I mean, the, the, as I said before in the last one, the correct club face at this point would look like that. Oh, it wouldn't even look like that. It would look like that. So when you get it there, by twisting that right palm more to the ground, see your palm straight up at the sky here? Then you come down, there's that separation of your arms that you're talking about. That's You, you are overly concerned about your old over-the-top move, but I, I can only correct what I see now. If this arm went out more in front of you and, and, and what I call, you're, you're right, what Manzella calls tumbling over, or what I call pronating uh, the palm downward, it would allow you to move your body and not do that. Okay, so that's the synopsis as we stand right now. Thanks for the business. Send me students.